Hi, my name is Matt Fleming, founder of Allison Small Business Solutions. There's been a lot of talk these days about people purchasing hard drives and used computers in pawn shops and Goodwill stores and being able to recover sensitive financial and personal information off of what people thought were erased hard drives. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how to turn this, your computer's old hard drive, into this, a completely unusable piece of molten matter, completely protecting your data, keeping it out of the hands of identity thieves. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to take our hard drive and you'll notice the screws around the outside are a special type of screw called a Torx screw. That's T-O-R-X. You can pick up drivers in pretty much any hardware store around the country. This particular model is a multi-purpose Torx wrench that I purchased at Lowe's for around five dollars. The next item we're going to need is our safety goggles. You never know what's going to happen because we are dealing with open flame, which brings us to our map gas blowtorch. I prefer map gas because it does tend to burn a little hotter than your standard propane torch, which helps us get the job done a little bit faster. So go ahead and start taking apart your hard drive using your Torx wrench on the outer screws. And then once you have all the screws taken out, you'll notice the cop comes off quite easily, exposing the inside of the hard drive. This is the business portion that we want to get to, and that is the platter. And you'll notice once the screws are all removed, the platter comes out quite easily, revealing a nice shiny disc. All right, so now that we've taken the platter out of the hard drive, we can go ahead and dispose of the rest of the contents. What I have down here on my workbench are some landscape bricks that I took out of the backyard, and that's going to keep the heat from going down and doing any damage to my workshop area. So I'm going to go ahead, put on my fashionable safety glasses, and here we go. So here is our nice little hard drive platter there, just waiting to meet its maker. I'm going to go ahead and fire up my map gas torch. And just kind of hold it in a little bit area here. I don't know if you can see this or not, but it's starting to... Let me try to zoom in a little bit more here starting to cake up a little bit. You can see the top protective layer starting to bubble up. And this is good. This is exactly what we want to have happen. Now, I recommend map gas over your standard propane just because it burns a little hotter and gets the job done faster. Obviously, if you have access to, say, an oxyacetylene torch. That'll work good, too. And look at this. Now we just go completely around the platter. There you go. And now you can see we've pretty much liquefied the unit. You can see the liquid mass there as I run my screwdriver through it. It's all bubbly. So I'm going to do is let that cool for just a second. And then I'm going to flip it over. And just torch the other side real quick. Again, very hot molten hard drive. So you can see the damage we did pretty much went through to the other side, but I'm just going to give a quick once over because I can. And there you go. We have one properly destroyed hard drive platter. All of our data is safely destroyed and we do not have to worry about anybody stealing our social security number, bank statements, credit card information, or any other personal data that they see fit.
Well, there you go. Just a small price to pay for the peace of mind in knowing that our data is safely destroyed and will not fall into the wrong hands. Again, my name is Matt Fleming. Thanks for tuning in. And if you need any computer help whatsoever, feel free to call us 702-804-9289. Thanks again.